thing. I have never in my days played a Persona 4 related anything unless you count like Blaze Blue Cross Tag Battle. This is the first Persona 4 related thing I have ever touched that was made by Atlas. I'm not playing the original Persona 4. I am playing the dancing spin-off game that came out in like 2016, I believe. It was either 2016 or 2018, and 3 and 5 Dancing would come out 2020, but I don't think that's what happened. I think it was 2016 for Persona 4, and then 2018 for 3 and 5, and then they all got bundled into the Dancing, like, the Dancing cole Collection, which I bought for like $20, and now here we are. I'm actually really excited to stream this. Because when I first bought it, I told Asheville Nova that I was going to first beat Persona 5 and 3 on my own time. And then stream this one. Because for whatever reason on the PlayStation Store, you cannot, and I mean you cannot buy any of the DLC for this game. Unless you have already bought the Dancing All Night Collection. Which I know isn't the title of the collection, but we're going to call it that. You straight up cannot play this. Or, well, I mean, it makes sense. You cannot buy the DLC unless you own this, which I guess makes sense. But what doesn't make sense is that you can buy any of the other DLC for this game. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and jump straight into it. Uh, hello, YouTube. This is probably going to be a VOD upload. I'm not going to edit the thing. Uh, this is the first of what I can hopefully assume many potential uh, future streams that turn into playthroughs. So, let's get straight into it. Uh... Uh, I gotta go through all the DLC. <laughs> no! Stop! I already have all this. Atlas. Yes. P-Studio. Nobody ever says the name for P-Studio. Cryware. They made Sonic. That was the engine for Sonic Adventure, I think. I really want to skip this, because this is going to have audio issues. Persona 4. Dancing all night. The title screen... Okay. Uh, can I edit the audio? Like, the sound? I can't. Okay. I need to... Ooh, this is menu, though. Okay. Click your... Okay, audio. We're gonna have it at, like, 40, because we had, uh, 5 dancing at 30, and that was really quiet, so we're gonna have, uh, 4 dancing at 30 as well. Uh, everything at... Or 40, I mean, at 40. Dance voices, yes, please. Why would I turn the best feature of the game off? We're just gonna leave everything the same, except... Okay. I'm actually really excited to play this. So... Free dance. Oh, oh, this wasn't in. Uh, I don't think this is in three and four or three and five dancing. Oh, hi, Teddy. <laughs> All right, let's begin. I'm excited for this. In story mode, you can enjoy the story of Persona 4 dancing. First, select mode to proceed. The the mode will only affect story mode and is separate from free dancing. Uh, let's let's go with beginner. I'm not very good at. Uh, oh, oh, they're, they're chapters. This is way different than, uh, 5 and 4, or 5 and 3, sorry. Um, I'm pretty excited. Again, I want to check the audio before I get into this. So I'm going to quickly check the audio on the stream, and then I will be right back. i this audio so it doesn't sound like poopy. Let us begin with Persona 4 Dancing. I'm excited. Oh, I still have the audio pulled up. I don't want to have that up while I'm streaming. Awesome. For what? Oh, what did we audition for? What is... I don't know what... Take care now. Thanks for everything. Thank you for staying so late. Thank you so much. See you. Uh-oh. That's not good. She f dropped something. What's that? Colors. I love colors. Hi, who am I? Who, who, whose point of view am I? Oh, I'm not anybody's point of view. Can I take a shot in the dark and say that's Yukiko? <laughs> I only know the characters through the anime, so don't ha hurt me, please. I watched the anime, I never played the game. Or the animation, and I never played the game, so... Uh, okay. Yuko -san? Yuko. Is it Yuki? Is that like short for Yukiko? Or is that just a, so a totally different character? 
You fall over everything, don't you? You really... It's 12 o'clock. What's going on? What? What? What's going on? I don't like this. Why is she crying? I don't get it. What's happening? I don't like this. What the? Was that it a scream? It was from the studio. Hey! What? What's going on? <laughs> I did not expect this dancing game to open up like this. Every other dancing game just has them awaken in the velvet room. Uh, actually, they always have their own two stories. When you look at some website at midnight, there's this weird video that plays. Is that like the midnight channel? Is that back? Is the midnight it's channel back? Make out much at first, but you can totally see this idol who should be dead dancing in it. What? When you watch the video to the end, supposedly you get taken away to the other side, and you never wake up. Wow. Midnight Channel. This is definitely an original story. I I'm still excited. I'm still really excited. Where am I? Did I get pulled into the video? Did we watch the video? Are we dumb? Uh, uh, uh what's going on? Hi! Oh, this is, this is, okay. I'm not disappointed because when you awaken, you are greeted with an unfamiliar sight. Can I, is there an option to have auto text? I don't want to, I don't want to, is there auto text? Auto advance, yes. Thank God. Okay. When you awaken, you are greeted with an unfamiliar sight. The floor, walls, even the ceiling, everything in this mysterious room is colored a deep ultramarine. Before such, before you sit in a uh, similarly yet, I don't know. Oh. Whatever. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Hi, Margaret. Don't oh. worry. This is merely a dream. The you in the real world is sound asleep. So I guess if you guys Having don't know, 3 that, and 5 use no 3D models. This, uh, this uh, goes for the more traditional sense of the... She fixes uh, you with a piercing stare. Okay, I, I'm turning auto-advance off. I changed my mind. It's too fast. Into a realm beyond your ken. So this is more like Persona... The, just the Persona games from yonder like three and four, where they just used images and text boxes. They still do the same in five, but it's a lot less pronounced, I think. But I, I still like it. This is the, is the velvet. velvet. Oh, I'm, I'm a not A place talking. that exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. That sounds awesome. Normally, I like the little, little the splash of colors whenever you hit next. That's here. awesome. This game's cool. After saying so, she turns her gaze downward as if in contemplation. What do we do? But nothing meaningless happens in this room. Awesome. If you are here, there must be a reason for it. If this is like three and four, or three and five, god damn it. If this is like three and five, then I assume we're gonna Very have to well. dance our way out of here. I'll use this as an opportunity to tell you of a guest we once hosted here. Cool. Who is it? The woman before you straightens her posture slightly, then faces you directly. Do we not. Does you not. Re like, you nor Kami not remember Margaret? Because this is really making me think that she is. It seems she's going. Or is this? Are we even you, Narukami, right now? Are we just ourselves? It seems she's going to tell you a story about someone other than yourself. Who does she intend to tell you about? Is it Makoto yes. Yuki from Persona 3? I know just whose story to relate. Or is it Persona 5's Randomami? <laughs> this is the tale of an unforgettable guest who kindled within my heart a flame that none of our countless visitors could match. Okay. I knew him as you, Narukami. Okay, so we aren't ourselves, or we are ourselves. In overcoming a terrible ordeal that befell a certain town, he formed an irreplaceable bond with his friends. I haven't played the game yet, so I can't really confirm or deny that. The power of their bond supported them through every trial, even when facing an adversary oh, okay. with inhuman That's what that meant. I didn't understand what hide window meant for a second. They remained undaunted throughout. That sounds cool. <laughs> I really want to play the game. I, I really hope that Persona 4 comes to, uh, like, current gen. Like, instead of just PC. I'm not surprised. I'm not really perplexed. Uh, perplexed. I'm not really perplexed. what I'm speaking of, after all. I... You know, from personal experience, I don't. But from secondhand experience, I do. In that case... I will show you a glimpse into the story after they overcame their ordeal. So am I going to play Persona 4 in this? When the woman raises her hand, brilliant light slowly floods your surroundings. Whoa! To be clear, this is not the story of the ordeal they faced. What is it then? Hmm. 
One might think of it as a festival that they performed in, at the risk of their own lives. Is this the one where Yo Yosuke signs up every single female into the beauty pageant or whatever? Is that what this is? I want to play the games. I only watch the animation. Okay. Chapter 1-1. One, one. Oh, slick, awesome PNGs I can use in thumbnails. Starting chapter. Proceed. Yes, please. Oh, funky beats. Production company, Takura Productions Practice Studios. Is it Takura or Takura? I'm an English man. I'm not Japanese. So I, I'm scared. So if I pronounce any of these wrong, I'm sorry. I'm probably going to bounce back and forth from what I think it is and what it probably is. So I'm sorry about that. But I am not Japanese. I do not understand. So I'm going to stick with Takura. But it could be Takura, and I have no idea. But I'm pretty sure it's the same thing nonetheless. About half a year passed since we solved the case that took place. That round, about half a year has passed since we solved the case that took place in the peaceful rural town of Inaba. Well, I'm spitting hot on fire. <laughs> anyway, summer vacation has been over for a while, but the heat still claims. Today we had to come to a certain production company's office for a particular purpose. Where are we? I just... never mind. Takura Productions. Rise sounds very late. It's past time for our lesson already. I can understand that some people have not played Persona 4. It, I kind of wish there was a setting that was like, you've played Persona 4, so I didn't have to be like, huh, who's this Kina? I know that's Naoto. I know who that is. Upon saying, yeah, Naoto looks upon the clock at the wall. Naoto Shiragane, or Shir... Shir I, I don't know. She's an underclassman and one year younger than me, but she's a, de a detective in a fifth generation of distinguished Shiragane family. When I first met her, she had problems with her how others saw her and presented herself as an adult man. Now, though, she shifted away from that. I nod to Naoto before talking or taking my own cell phone, scanning the back of the screen. I'll text her voicemail from her. What about you? <laughs> oh, he comes in to do voices! Yes! Oh my god, I did not like the fact that the Persona 3 or 5 protagonist had almost no vocal lines when it came to the cutscenes. They talked all the time during the dancing, but god, I wish they talked more during, like, in, like, social events. And Yu talks because they weren't afraid to have Johnny Youngbosch come back and do the voice for him. Me neither, it seems. I Although I do believe... Happened. I think this is the game where they changed Naoto's voice actor to someone else. I, I, I wouldn't be able to tell but you. in that case... I think you'd be the first one Risei-san would contact, Senpai. Yeah, probably. Risei Kujikawa, she's an underclassman at a year younger than me like Naoto. She's a teen idol famous across Japan working under this company, Takuro Productions. Just like Naoto, she had her own issue to deal with. Her own issues to deal with. When we first met her, Risei had been on a hiatus from her work as an idol. However, the year we spent together helped her grow and she's currently in the midst of making her comeback to showbiz. Actually, Risei's comeback is essentially the reason why ordinary high school students like us are here in the first place. Should I give her a call? Should I start pretending to be... Like, should I start trying to mimic Yu's voice? Or should I stop reading it in my own? It's no, hard to... We can wait a I can't longer. really decide. Yeah, well, we're patient. schedule is tight to begin with. It's us who are imposing on her time. Or, to make me rather, feel? it's me. What do you mean? What are we here for? My finger hovers over the call button, but I stop at Naoto's words and put my cell phone away in my pocket. It's true, Risei must be very busy. It it may be better to wait a little longer and see what happens. Just like thinking this, now to Who's a good conversation topic? It still seems so hard to believe. Talking makes me tired. For me, of all people, to be standing in a production studio awaiting dance lessons. We're all doing dance I lessons. I couldn't have aren't pictured we? it either. If it wasn't for Risei's comeback performance. The Love Meets Bonds Festival. They're calling it LMB for short, correct? Little man boy, I yeah, that, no, I take that back. That was gross. Yeah. I've heard TV crews will be there on the day of the concert. Awesome. That's right. We'll be participating as backup dancers in the performance at LMB, the debut show for Risei's comeback. Of course, Risei aside, we're just we're all just amateurs. We're going to need a lot of practice before we handle a real show. So far, our practice has been extremely rigorous, and it's continuing on now. Oh, ballroom dancing, I could have managed. I'm entirely useless at How this. can you be useless at dancing? You just gotta get better. I felt much more at ease fighting helping. monsters in a strange world than I feel here. Well, maybe then the fog should just come back now, though. How would you feel about that? Someone's at the door. It better be Yosuke. Oh, man, I'm so <laughs> late. Nope, that's I'm not so Yosuke. Hi, uh, hi. Risei-san. Oh, thank goodness you're all right. My last meeting just wouldn't end. Were you two waiting long? Did they change Risei's voice actor here, too? I can't tell. 
Uh, I don't know what to say. No. Uh, no. no, it wasn't that long. Really? <laughs> I was pretty late, so I figured you'd be mad. No, we why would I be? Against you. I'm with angry. With the music festival right around the corner, you must be overwhelmed with all the preparations. Probably. After all, it's not just we two you've been supervising. Oh, where's Yosuke? I heard that you're making time to give lessons to the others in Inaba as well. No, I want to talk to you. No, Kanji. Where's Kanji? As Naoto says, we three aren't the only ones, uh, ones of our friends who will be participating in this love meets bonds. The members of the event. Yes, Kanji. Yes, our friends who help solve the countless cases in distant Inaba will be performing at the festival as well. Yosuke, Chia, Yukiko, Kan, Kanji, uh, uh, and Teddy. Even now, the <laughs> are practicing her. Kanji is my favorite character in this game. Or, like, in the whole Persona 4 timeline, Kanji is my favorite character. I love him. He's so funny. So, Risa is busy with work. She's been going back and forth between here and Inaba to help teach our friends in the country. Well, everyone's pitching in to help. Was that county or country? Senpai, Naoto kun my friends in Inaba. I want all of us to be our absolute best on stage, so I'll do whatever I can to help achieve that. She totally sounds different than Persona 4. I think they did change her actor But man, here. the festival producer's been a real pill about it. Or they changed it before this just game. Just a minute ago, she was going experience. on and on about throwing our money away on amateurs. It was like I wasn't in the room. I was seriously seeing red. Dead. We'll show her. We're gonna pull this off whatever it takes, and then she'll see how amazing all of you are. I hope so. You're a true professional. My hat is off to you. It's still on. You know it. So you can't slack off either, Nato-kun. Come on, let's get this rehearsal start. They definitely changed their actor. Uh-oh, somebody's at the door. Is it Kanji? Oh, good. No, nah, that's not Kanji. Here. Can there be a couple more of us like Kanji? Okay, I'll, I'll stop yapping no, about Kanji. What's up? Wait, is that you, Nozomi? Oh my gosh! Hey, girls, it's been forever! That's a guy. The man called in... How did she say it? Wait, is that you, Inoue-san? In the man called Inoue gives a smile and introduces the room we're in. There are numbers of girls behind them. I don't recognize I'm any of them. I'm sorry to interrupt your practice, Yukun and Naoto-kun. Oh, Thank you. Risa-san's manager. Uh, okay. Could you spare a moment of your time? There are some people I'd like to introduce you both to. They're okay. another idol group with Takura Productions. Okay, it's Takura. At LMB too. Or Takura? I gotta I got check again. They're another idol group with Takura. Takura. Okay. Who are all of you? Allow me to introduce Nozomi Nakahara. So we have Westview, not Mitsuru, not uh, not Yukari. These not the next generation Rise and, and Rise Fem <laughs> and literally Femsi, but not Femsi from Persona 3 Portable, like literally just the female main character of Persona 3. Okay. <laughs> They're all just, they all look like previous Persona characters. Sort of. Okay, maybe not Yukari is not anywhere near Yukari, but come on. As I recall, they're members of Konamine Kitchen. Konamine Kitchen, is wow, that like Hell's so cool. Kitchen That's for right. Japan? You sure do your homework on this stuff. But it's just you four? Where's Konami? There's Konami a fifth one? doing PR right now for her solo photo book that's out soon. What's PR? Press, press report? Konamine, Ki Konamine? Whatever. I recall hearing that name. I recall hearing that name. I see, they're members of that group. If I remember right, they're a popular idol group made to center around the... Uh, but another one of Risa's juniors. I can't. I don't want to mispronounce that name. I'm tired of going back and looking too, so I'm just gonna try. The four girls you know I saw and brought here make up the group Kanamin Kitchen minus Kanami herself right now. You know, Kanami. Kanami. You've been pushing Kanami too much lately. Tomoe. You mean not Minako or Makoto from from Free? Is a good thing. That's not my problem. <laughs> You don't mince words, do you, Tomoe chan? Probably not. I mean, I would assume that she didn't, right? Well, I have to be direct. LMB is just around the corner. Yeah, it is. It is literally right around the corner. Do you understand that even now we're behind on rehearsing? Excuse me? We are? Oh, I do. Trust me. I know how big that event is going to be for your group. Cool. Hey, I want to do photo book work, too. I want to model lots of outfits like cute Hi, not, not Yukari, too. Not you. 
not resay. All right, some Momo Chan, yeah. just calm down. If a job like that comes in, I'll make sure you get a crack at it. Tomoe san gives me a weary sigh as so Sumomo san clings to an oi san like a pouting child. I forgot to hit next. They're supposedly Risei's juniors, but I actually can't read on any can't get a read on any of their actual ages. It's a little baffling. Okay, I could probably guess their ages. They're probably all just barely not legal. While I'm thinking it over, Naoto, who seems startled by their presence in a completely different way, mutters something somewhat taken aback. This is a bit overwhelming. It's like being in a room with five Risei sons. Is that a bad thing to you? I don't know Risei on a personal Am level. Am I that much like them? Is that what you think of your coach, hmm? Oh, uh, no. That wasn't my intent at all. This game's funny. Hmm. So this guy's you, son? I'm not really getting a Yukari vibe out of you anymore. I'm thinking more... I don't know. I'm thinking more... Oh! Um... Shoot, what was her? Ah, oh, man. Ah, oh, 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 I gotta remember. She looked... She was angry all the time in, like, Persona 5. And it's fine because Persona 5 came out before this game came out, right? No, it came out after? Maybe? I, I don't care anymore. Did I do something to offend her? Is it my face? Is there something on my face? No, that's not the problem. Oh, I thought you were about to say it's a big fat glob of ugly. I'm not falling for it. You seem way too cool. I don't like it one bit. Hey, don't diss you like Jeez, that. There she goes again. She's king. He's king. Awesome. I'm sorry, senpai. She's always quick to pick fights with anyone and everyone. And I'm always quick to win them. I see. So that's the kind of girl she is. When I'm when I nod at Risa's words, Tanime sound dramatically points at me. What now? Just you wait, Yusan. What am I waiting the on? Next time I see you, I'll have a herd of boys with me. All of them better and dreamier than you. Not possible. It'll be a boy trail that goes so far back you can't see the end. Like a goldfish's you know what. I don't know what. I don't understand what you're talking about. The air in the room goes frigid at Tanami sounds bizarre. It's for like example. Is that intentionally awkward? Or should I say something and back her up? Sorry, Tamami chan isn't very good at metaphors. Tamami, not Tanami. I was saying Tanami this whole time! It's Tamami. Wait, why'd you go with you know what? Are we not supposed to say goldfish poop? <laughs> <laughs> I like this character well, already. I don't think saying poop in and of itself would damage <laughs> Okay. Image. Though, when you go out of your way to avoid saying it like that, it just calls more attention to it. Shut up! Bah, <laughs> just say poop. Uh-oh. Oh, they're fighting. I thought that an earthquake was happening. Sumomo-san darts away as Tamami-san chases her, while Tomoe-san watches in exasperation. It suddenly became a sketch comedy. That's when the last member standing next to Inoue-san steps forth and smiles cheerfully. Her name was...